Good morning. It's Monday. Beautiful. <laughs> well, interesting anyway. Yes, it's Monday. Just gone eight o'clock, I think. And I'm, I'm, I was like, why am I up? Twenty past eight. Like, why am I up? Like, I've done, I've done my listings challenge. Why am I up? I, I don't know. I think it's the the use to get enough. Just remembered meds, people. If you haven't taken your meds, go get them right now. And a nice big glass of water. Drink your water, take your meds, non-negotiable, okay? Here comes mother. Hello, mother. You're just waving, okay? It's We're Monday. Doomed again. We're doomed again. Oh, bugger, not again. That's the third time this week and it's only Monday. What are we gonna do? Do you want a drink? Eat chocolate. <laughs> yeah. Make cake. Make cake. Um, oh, that reminds me. Lodo. Mm -hmm. You know, they've got them chocolate flavour cake bars. Yeah. They're introducing two new flavours today. Mm. So I'm going to order some. They've got a lemon drizzle flavour and a caramel crunch. Ooh, lemon drizzle. Oh, I was thinking caramel crunch, but there we are. Yeah. Let's you have a... You like sweeter things. Not really, I, I prefer more savoury stuff. But the idea caramel of. Is very sweet. Yeah, but caramel crunch. Yeah, well, you can't have either anyway. Meh. So I have they... one of my nice oaty biscuits. Yeah, alright, shut up. The ones that make me bloat like straight away. It's probably the oats. No, I'm not. The It'll be the wheat flour. Never mind. Oh, they're not I'm on their way. I'm making it with almond flour. I'm trying making it with almond flour. No, it's okay. It's still got loads of sugar. It still says coming soon on their website. When? When? Now? I want to buy. Rich chocolate cake. Oh, I didn't figure. Oh, I thought it wouldn't be. I was hoping it wasn't going to be chocolate flavour. Topped with caramel and crispy, crispy cocoa in low sugar dark chocolate coating oh no and there's another one double chocolate fudge flavor too too much and lemon drizzle soft moist lemon sponge topped with lemon layer covered in a low sugar white chocolate coating you won't like that because it's white chocolate can't have any anyway so no exactly no you don't close, close door door I want to order them. Boxes of ten coming soon. Well, I'll order some later when they when they thing. I'll definitely order some and I'll do a little tasty testy. Mm. Right, my list of stuff for today is post. At the moment, I've got forty two to post, and I'm waiting on payments for two. So that's pretty good. That's good. I've got to put stuff in garage. So those job lots that I did yesterday, I've got to pop them in the garage. But as you can maybe see, it's looking quite, quite miserable out there. Um, I'm going to fix my t-shirt. So that one that I um, had delivered from Boohoo. I'm still in two minds as to whether to send it back and get small size in it. Um, but... I don't know. I don't know if I could be bothered with like that. It is a five pound t-shirt. I am going to cut the sleeves off and cut um, a better neckline in it. And it'll just be like a trapeze style dress on me, I think. It's like a little slouchy t-shirt dress. And happy new rug day to me. Happy new rug day to me. Should be coming today. For that floor there. How's me? Are you okay then? Job kit done. That floor there will be covered in rug. You saw my belly in there. But yeah, isn't that exciting? Yes, it is. It is exciting. What an exciting day we have in store today. 
a new robe and do a new post and cake. <laughs> um, in Nick and Andrea's chat last night, they would, um, I mean, they get and you know, and in Carla's and. It does get mentioned quite a lot about uh, feeling depressed and stuff like that. And, you know, depression, not just because of COVID, but also because post Christmas, because um, it's winter, it's like that outside. It's fucking miserable. Um, and uh, that is why I do those challenges, like the experiments and stuff. Um, because it's a focus on a thing and and say like I couldn't go out last week not because of Covid or anything like that I couldn't go out because I was working that's you know so it's alright so I'm not missing out on stuff because like I've got, I've got to work this week sorry I can't come out I've got to work this week you know um, and now I don't have to work this week now it feels weird again like I don't have that focus, but I will find things to do. Some of it will probably be spending money. I've already, as you can see, mentally spent about 60 quid on some cake. Not that much, I won't spend that much, but you know what I mean. It's got, it, something has got to give. And a lot of the time with me, it's spending money. Oh, and lad, I just remembered that I effed up yesterday on telling you the totals because I added them up again yesterday and actually I had done 684 listings last week which when I added that up last night I was like should I just sit down and do 16 listings now and get it up to 700 no it's like uh, who have I got to prove that to just myself and I feel like I've let myself down I haven't that was awesome and from those, let me just double check of what's sold overnight. Um, have any more of these sold? Do, do, do. Um, another one there. Excuse me, people. I will be back with you momentarily. Just scrolling through my solds. And that one. And that one. And that one, and that one. I think that's it. Oh no, and that one. Okay, so 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 41 of what I listed last week I sold. So that's pretty good. I don't know what that is as a percentage. It's a missing percent. I'm quite pleased with that. Anyways. Let's quit gabbing on and at some point I'm going to get stuff from the garage and put stuff in the garage and uh, pack it up. Not just for fun, it's because that's what people have ordered. Back with you soon. Rug is here. Rug. It's big. It'll be good. I need a big rug. I do. <laughs> right. I mean, should really move table out of the way, but we can move too. <laughs> I like it. 
I will like it, won't I? It's leopard print. Leopard prints are neutral. As me, you might want to move out of the way, don't you? That's okay. Oh, it's good though, isn't it? Yeah. It's very big. It's huge. I love my rug. Rug, rug, rug. It feels so nice. And it was £160 delivered. I think that's alright, isn't it? It feels lovely, honestly. It's like so nice and soft. It's lush. <laughs> right. Rugs have got to be paid for. And things have got to be posted. So, over on my settee there, I think is 11 bags of two kilo lots of jewellery. Because people have ordered quite a lot over the weekend, which is quite nice. So that's good. I hope they're, they're having fun with them. Right, other stuff. This will take a while. Okay. Stub lot of plastic and colourful rings, $7.99. Two plastic bangles, £8. Da -da -da. A job lot of like crucifixes and things like that went on auction for £29. That's quite good. Um, four kilogram lot of broken jewellery went auction for £14.99. A job lot of pendants went for 12.99 a crazy job lot of over 150 rings went for 32 pounds at auction bonkers um a vintage jewelry look which is that one uh went for 36 pounds and a penny um rings too there's rings too gone Ring six. Don't tell me I have to. Oh, one second, that's the door. I'm back. It was post. Hold on. 
I'll show you in a second what it was. Anyway, right. Rings two. So flowery rings, I think. Something like that. Uh, seven pounds. Um, rings one. Stretchy rings, seven ninety nine. A plastic multi-strand. Like lots of bits of plastic. Seven, uh, sorry, nine pounds that went for. A Scottish thistle brooch, seven pounds nineteen. Um, a sparkly pink angel necklace, uh, six pounds seventy five. A little Maltese cross brooch, Maltese cross. Uh, went for ten ninety nine. It's foreign silver that one. That's why. A Wonder Woman style upper arm bangle, uh, four pounds. A solid silver, and I mean solid silver. Um, pig pendant, hallmarked uh, Birmingham, I think. Seventeen grams hallmarked Birmingham. Um, went for thirty one ninety nine. Another Art Deco necklace. This one's lovely. It's, it's got some really nice, like, proper machine age makings. Went for £10. A little sparkly bow man pin. Went for £6. Uh, another little sparkly. This is a black sparkly Art Deco style necklace. Went for £7. A horse and carriage brooch seven pounds a yorkshire rose yorkshire rose went for six pounds a full pearl twisty necklace multi-strand went for 13.99 um this is going to ian hello ian um he bought this um designer bracelet i don't know who the designer is um because i i we couldn't work out what the tag says on it, but I'm presuming that Ian probably knows. And um, paid eighteen pound for it, so I hope I hope it's worth like a hundred quid, and you know who it is and stuff, because I couldn't work it out. So, but thank you very much um, for that one, and there's a nice message in there as well. So thank you, um, Helen, Helen, Helen. Where's your cute little? Ah, oh, there it is. Um, cute little. Abalone bracelet, my little butterflies, isn't that cute? Um, and she says, Hi Lex, I've been watching your vlogs for a few weeks now, they are fantastic. Well, I heard that that's kind of over over egging, like what they, what they are. I wouldn't say fantastic, they're adequate at the best. <laughs> um, says, I'm from York too, like your mum. I um, hope you don't mind me messages. Um, uh, of course, you, you can you can message. That's perfectly fine. Thank you very much, Helen. Thank you for supporting my my business, um, and I hope you like your treat. And thank you very much. Yay. Um, oh, <laughs> what was next? Oh yes, um, um, a little job lot of parrot brooches went for eight pounds. A sterling silver zigzag ring. Where have you gone? Ring, ring. There you are. Um, went for eight pounds seventy nine. Some clip on earrings. These ones, silver tone ones, went for five pounds fifty nine. Uh, vintage nineties blouse went for ten pounds. Um, this cool ring which I had hoped would be like silver or white metal because it's got like a tiny little stamp on there but I took it to the jewellers to get tested and it's not unfortunately but I think it's still left but that one sold for seven pounds obviously if that was gold it would have sold for about seven hundred <laughs> not quite seven hundred um this nice brooch went for six pound thirty nine a red vintage jumpsuit twenty one ninety nine a morning style, um, but 1970s necklace, went for £4.49. Some of these, I love these earrings. They're so trashy, I love them. Um, they went for £7.99. Um, gorgeous coral uh, necklace with like faux lapis. 
and stuff in there. Um, went for £20 and that's going abroad. And rings, job block four. Please tell me that it's here and that here it is. Pew. Uh, went for £8. And all of them. So I've got to package this beastly lot up now, but there's no rush. No rush. I might just sit on my rug. <laughs> Post finally done. It's the afternoon now. That's how long it's taken. Crazy, huh? I mean, I was slightly distracted by rug. And then my order from Vista Print has come for business cards. I've ordered a thousand, and then this is where I find out that I've spelt my own name wrong. No, it looks okay. So that is my new business card. My old one had like um, my Instagram and Facebook on there, but my Instagram is more personal and my Facebook one I don't really use. So I'm just using up the last ones of those. So if somebody out there gets one in their um, like order, like that's why, because I'm just, you know, running through them now. But yeah, these are my new ones. So it just says eBay, Etsy, and YouTube, Bad Biscuit, Mystery Bags, badbiscuit.bigartel.com, and then email badbiscuit at outlook.com. Yeah, new stock added daily, vintage and retro jewellery, clothing and curios. That's me. I think it was like £17 for a thousand, so that's all right, isn't it? So I'm glad that it looks like I haven't spelled anything wrong on there. Woohoo! Success. Now lunch. Lunch today is very fatty. Yay. Two herd of frankfurters done in the... Um, air fryer and then covered in boursin cheese ah oh, beast man i'm looking for like a film to watch and i've just seen the bill and ted face the music it's there to buy on the playstation so 14 pounds oh man but i really want to watch it but that's a lot of money but i deserve a treat though don't i i mean it's what I work hard for. It's what I go to school for. Hmm, I'll have a little think. We'll see. I got me some movie snacks. And yep, I am gonna watch Bill and Ted face the music. Ooh, much excite. And it's a couple of hours later. Bill and Ted was all right. It was okay. Enjoyable enough. Not as good as the other ones, but you know. Um, anyway, dinner is some chicken. Um, that's like tomatoes and peppers and onions all fried together. Obviously kale, some tender stem broccoli and mayo. Yum, yum. If you haven't seen uh, this video already, go and check it out. This is Carla crying with happiness, obviously, at a, a lovely surprise look at their little face. So just a big thank you to Dawn who... Um, who uh, sent Carla a lovely gift and uh, thank you for making my friend very very happy it's very nice anyways that's me for the day because I'm not going to do anything else other than look at my lovely carpet and look at that sort of lovely television it'll be lovely when there's something on it to watch oh look look I can see Vivian Westwood doing it anyway it just looks like she's over on the shelf like in the background going hello she's not that would be weird Anyways, until next time, bye-bye now, bye-bye. Ah.